we are talking great buys here, not because necessarily because of price, but because of what they are. Yes, we are talking about my first ever purchase from Big Bad Toy Store here in this package. And uh, yeah, it's a huge box. I don't know if it's because of what's in there or because they packaged everything so well, but we're gonna open it up and check it out. Got the knife here. It's got some security tape with their name all over it, so you know they've got money clearly rolling in it. I don't know how big they're... I don't even know if they have like a retail store or not. Or if they're just an online store with a warehouse. So let me know if you've ever been to a big bad toy store retail store. I don't know, it's in the States, so... Who the heck knows, right? Not more, not more. But... Uh, yeah... Okay, so, this is my, this is pointless, <laughs> this is not even a, an invoice of any kind, then I get my, essentially a little card here advertising stuff, we got Transformers Optimus Prime, Star Wars The Last Jedi Mobile Suit Gundam Star Trek, and then on this side, Gotham by Gaslight, Kingdom Hearts, Spider-Man, Carnage, Venom, and some cups from Transformers. So, so I guess they're advertising other products. <sighs> Alright. So, honestly, this isn't the best packing job I've ever seen. In fact, it's, it's not very good at all. There's a lot of space, and they didn't fill it. They just threw bubble wrap on top of everything, hoping that it would... Uh, I don't even know I was getting that. So, yeah, this is movie related, but not movies, obviously, because it's toys. But as always, I love me some toys related to movies. So, first up is my first ever SH Monster Arts. This is Godzilla. Should be 1954. Yes. So, this is the black and white. Wow, they're smaller than I really, really are smaller. The packaging is big with this dude inside. It's like half the, half the box. That's crazy. I guess his tail takes up so much. <laughs> but there you go. Godzilla 1954, my first one. First of many, hopefully. Um, so, that's awesome. Again, like I said, some bubble wrap. And then this one was listed as uh, less than perfect. And this was a sci fi Revoltech Alien Warrior series number 16. So this is from the Revoltech sci-fi line, and it's the Alien Warrior from Aliens. And the box was listed as less than perfect, but I have n I don't see anything wrong with it. So, yeah, to me this is considered mint, so who the heck knows. But, uh, that's too awesome. Oh, it has a little, little egg, too. That's cool. So, there you go. I may do a, I don't know if I'll do an unboxing on this channel or not, but yeah, I had to pick that up because it was on sale. I was like, yeah, I will take one of those. And I picked one of these up because they were on sale and I might get some more. This is from Bandai. It's part of their stage line and this is the stage act um, thing so you can put your robots and such on them. Um, hang stuff um, and such and they joined together so there you go um, this wasn't too bad this wasn't too expensive that's why I just threw it on because I was paying for shipping anyways um, and I do know they had more than one of these so I'll probably pick up a few of them um, just so you can you know display the robots and such on there whether they be transformers or or uh, Chogokin or whatever heck you could probably put a an alien figure or anything but this oh this is actually quite huge holy crap this is the reason for the purchase I saw these and I was like yes I have to get on that this is MP2 from the Transformers masterpiece line um, but this is the I think it's the re-release um, with the five cassettes so it, this is the Soundwave masterpiece 
the five cassette, so it has laser beak, it has buzzsaw, it has rumble, it has frenzy, and ravage. So all the cassettes, everything to go. It's got an energon cube, because you know in the series he popped out energon cubes. It was essentially like his job. And uh, yeah, so that's awesome. And uh, I didn't know this, but apparently this release had a came with a what is this? What they're calling a masterpiece sound wave with five mini cassettes, mini sound wave. So this is a mini sound wave. I don't know, have any idea about it whatsoever because you can't see any. There's no pictures or anything. So. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it, maybe it's him as cassette form. I don't know if it transforms or what. If it does, that, that'd be awesome. Um, maybe it does. Who knows with the Masterpiece stuff. Um, but, uh, yeah, I don't know if I... Okay, I could definitely open this up. The uh, sticker is not um, too sticky that it'll wreck the packaging and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah, again, I'm not going to open this up here. Um, I may do an unboxing somewhere at some point, but it's not going to happen here. Um, but yeah, there there's some toys, man. Some crazy toys. Uh, very, very expensive. This was very expensive. <laughs> and I got hit with duty, custom charges on top of it. So yeah, this essentially sapped up all my spending cash for uh, the entire month. Um, which... Uh, sucks but when you're buying premium premium toys like these that's what happens and uh yeah gotta love them I'm definitely getting more of the the godzilla stuff i may get more of these revoltech type things they do have a bunch of cool stuff on their lines and i'm kind of you know just looking at this i think i like this one better than the uh sh monster arts uh alien but uh Definitely would need require like a side-by-side -side comparison to really tell um, If you have both of them, let me know what you think if you have any of these things Let me know comment down below if you collect them love to hear from you till next video. Take care Have a good one